Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Amir Suleiman bin Abdul Samad and I'll be presenting for our group chapter which is chapter 5.4 IEEE 102.11 Medium Access Mechanism and our group member is Muhammad Akil and Iqbal. And for the process of medium access mechanism, as you can see here, it's wait for frame to transmit and then it will go to medium idle and it will see if it uh, no and then it will wait until the current transmission end and then it will wait for IFS and it will still check if it's still idle or no or yes. If it yeah, if it no, it will return back until the uh, it will wait until current transmission end, and the process will begin. If it's yes, it will exponential back off while medium idle. It will then transmit the frame, and the process will go back to the wait for frame to transmit, and the it will go to medium idle. If it yes, it will wait for the IFS. If it's still idle, and it will transmit frame and the process will repeat. Next slide. Uh, a station that want to transmit must sense whether the medium is in use. If the medium is in use, the station must defer frame transmission until the medium is not in use. The station determine the state of the medium using two methods. The first method being physical sense, which check the layer one physical layer to see whether a carrier is present. And the second method, which is virtual sense, use the virtual carrier sense function, the network allocation vector. Next. I will pass it to my friend. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'll continue. Uh, for example, Suppose Mata is sending a frame to George, Vivian also receives frame with a uh, nav equal 10 millisecond. Does not attempt transmission until the NAV has decremented to zero. Uh, also, station only update NAV when the duration field value received greater than what is currently stored in their NAV. Now I'll pass it to my friend, Akil. Hello, hello. Yes, now I will continue the slide on media access mechanism uh, revisit. So yeah, this is uh, the general uh, 802.11 frame which include frame control, duration ID, address one, address two, address three, sequence control, address four, frame body and FCS. So the duration ID, uh, the, so the duration OID field, is the number of uh, microseconds, millions of seconds, the, that the medium is expected to remain busy for transmission currently in progress. Transmitting device sets the duration times in the microseconds. Uh, it includes times to transmitting this frame to the AP or to the client if an AP, the returning acknowledgement and the time in between frames, AF, AF, IFS, interframe spacing. All stations monitor this field. All stations update their NAV, which is network allocation vector timer. And the transmitting station must wait a specific amount of time after the medium becomes available. This time value is known as the DFS ECF interface space. Once the DIFS interface elapses, the medium becomes available for station access contention. Next, I will pass it to Bazari to continue with the slide.
Hello, Assalamualaikum. Uh, I will continue to the next slide, which is uh, the media access. Uh, first, Vivian and Josh might want to transmit frame when Martha's transmission is complete. Both stations should have the same NAV values and both will physically sense when the medium is idle. There is a high probability that both stations will attempt to transmit when the medium becomes idle, causing a collision. To avoid this situation, DCF use, uses a random backoff timer, which is the random backoff algorithm, randomly select a value from zero to the contention window, CW value. Uh, when the Vivian ready to transmit, her uh, NAV timer has documented to zero and the physical also indicate the medium is idle. Vivian select a uh, random back off time, in this case, CW is four, and with the selected number of slot time for transmitting. After four slot time pass, Vivian can transmit. But what if Josh station has a random back off time of two time slots? Vivian update her NAV with that new value, Vivian must wait for her NAV to decrement to zero and her physical to report that the medium is available again before she can resume her back off. In this example, Vivian must wait an additional two slot time before attempting to transmit, which is we can see the example from the on the uh, this slide in this station. And then I think that's all from our. Thank you.